Hey guys, it's Peggy Dean of The Pigeon Letters. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make a cute do-it-yourself envelope. So what you need to get started is a piece of cardstock, and I use double-sided patterned cardstock so that the inside also is just as exciting as the outside. And you don't have to have a heart template. I just have this because I've done a bunch of these and that way I can reference it and just use that so I know that my heart's perfect. Otherwise, what you can do is fold it in half, crease it, and then draw that line. But the reason why I like to have the template is because I don't want that crease in my envelope. So if you guys went to elementary school, you probably remember, all you do is you fold it, draw that line so it goes up, around, and down, and meets, and then cut it, and then open it up, and you have a heart. So what we're gonna do is center that, and then trace it. I have a pencil, and I'm just going to do a quick trace around the edges here. And then I'm going to cut that shape out. So it doesn't have the crease in the middle. Okay, so once you have cut out your heart out of the cardstock, you'll also just need some glue or you can use that double-sided tape, whatever you prefer. Whichever side you want the outside to be, make sure that's on the bottom. So I want these arrows to be on the bottom and I'm going to have the bottom of the heart, the tip, toward the top. And then I'm going to take the sides of the heart and I'm going to fold them in like so. It doesn't really matter how far you do it, just make sure that each side is even and you want to make the crease straight up and down so that this is all even. So this goes, this goes down at an angle and then it goes straight down. And so the width here wants to match the width here. That looks about even. So I'm going to crease that. And then I always use the back of my scissors um, or the handle of my scissors to do a hard crease. I find it helps a lot. There we go. So now we're going to flip this part up. The bottom part of this is going to reach the top here. So the crease is going to be right about in the middle. There we go. And then you have the beginning of your envelope and as I don't know if you guys can tell this side's a little bit longer than this side you can always go back in and adjust that so since I can see it, it looks like the center should be right about here so I'm just gonna go in and adjust it and make that a straighter line like that and that looks a lot better so right here what we want to do is tape or glue and you want to make sure it's only on the edges and I'm just using the Tombow Mono Liquid Glue and it's got a broad tip here and then it has the point tip right here. So I'm just going to squeeze that until it starts and starts coming out and then just cover my surface area there, do it to the other side. And when that's done, and now I'm going to fold it up and get that bond. And if you're using glue, you'll wanna keep that pressure on there. You can set something on top of it or you can hold it until it is at least tacky, but preferably all the way dry. Once that's dry, we're going to flip the top part over. So you're gonna crease it at the top of that beginning heart, like so. And then you have your envelope and that's it. And if you guys like this video, please be sure to thumbs up and subscribe and I will get some more tutorials your way soon. We'll see you next time.